37 years. 32 years. For 8 years. 9 years. 39 years. Since 2011. Since 1983. Since I was in the womb because no doubt my father already put on scorpions when my mother was still pregnant with me. 30 years. 34 years. Since 1990. 8 years. 36 years. 6 or 7 years. Since autumn 1984. Since 1999. That is 20 years of pure rock and roll. 8 years. Since I was 6. 34 years. 13 years. From the 80s. Since 1976. 26 years. 7 years. 5 years. 12 years. 14 to 15 years. 5. Great. Broken. Yeah. Yeah. 25 years. 8 years. 1978 10 years no more more 12 years yes that's it since 1984 i was raised with scorpions in the womb 16 years 38 years 10 years one year 15 years 30 years 42 years this me be sick. 16 years 35 years. 15 years. 10 years. Over 40 years. About 6 years. Depuis je suis toute petite. 30 plus years. 10 years. 3 years. 12 years. Je suis toujours 18 ans. 34 ans. About 20 years. De l'année 1975. 12 years. Over 15 years. Примерно 6-7 ans. 8 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 ans. About three years. Уже 10 лет. Шесть лет. Almost nine years. Almost six years. Уже commercial on TV, maybe they were promoting the show. I even remember how it sounded and what part it was. I was a little boy and it was a really great moment. I remember closing my eyes and let the music take me away. It was pretty amazing. I heard her in 2007 по одному из ташкентских радио, и тогда мне показалось, что это лучшая музыкальная композиция, которую я когда-либо слышал. When the smoke is going down, since the moment I heard first notes of the sound, I was stood absolutely paralyzed, because never in my life I had never heard before such a strong and powerful combination of the strange and beautiful sound of the guitar and amazingly amazing and fantastic voice of the Klaus Meiner I heard it and I stood up completely paralyzed I stayed up paralyzed it seems to me that <laughs> I forgot how to breathe I didn't know the name of the band 
but I understood that it's something really great, it's something general. Fly people, fly. Fly. I was completely amazed when I heard this song. A few years ago when I met my wife, I realized that it is her favorite song. My brother Colin brought home the album and insisted that I learn all the lyrics and all the music. But you know what, I wore out the grooves on that album and I had to replace it. Totally worth it. Lonely Nights. I heard it at one of our concerts in the university. Black Black a friend of mine had it in his Walkman and he showed me and said, listen to that song. I said, wow, it's a cool song. And since then I was a really a big fan of the Scorpions. I went into the record shop. This guy used to buy albums and he played Blackout to me. And I heard that high energy music. I'm like, woohoo, I have to buy this. She said, I studied at school and uh, sometimes we made parties and uh, I heard it there. Sales of Sharon, that was the song. She sent me an angel because my dad was always playing the Acoustica DVD on the TV and I completely fell in love with that song. Top of the pill. My reaction was simple. I discovered in that moment exactly what I wanted to be. And the band that I would adopt for my heart. Sea of Change. And I distinctly remember hearing it on the radio the date was 7th of November, 1990. I still remember the date, how can I ever forget that? I was taking English classes back then and we were listening to different songs in English to improve our listening skills and this song was one of them. Romanian radio station started playing Western music after the revolution and I think the whistling part at the start of the song caught my attention and after that I started waiting for the song to come on again and again and again. I was waiting for my father in our car. I found a little cassette and turned the music on. I was surprised because it was a new genre of music for me. I was so excited and amazed at the same time. It was uh, the moment of glory. It was wind of change and it managed to change my life. I discovered Scorpion in the car of my father when I was 3-4 years old and I had to repeat it in a loop. Dad, can you put the song with the guy who sings? I liked the whistle, the melody. I couldn't understand the words, but I asked my dad what the band was and he said the Scorpions. And uh, I asked him for more songs of the band, but he said, Oh, you're too young for this, you won't appreciate them. And really, for many years, uh, Wind of Change was the only Scorpion song that I knew and that I listened to. Coming home. was when I was five or six years old when my dad drive me to school and he turned on a radio and there was a scorpions from uh, Pure Instinct that was so scary and too loud, too scary for me. All night long I was over at a friend's house and his older brother had it. I heard a little bit of it and knew I had to hear more. Dynamite. Um, my brother took me to this music store in Baghdad back in 1999 and they were playing the song Dynamite for the Scorpions from the Crazy World Tour DVD back in 1990. First time for me to see Matthias playing all the solos and I was going like crazy and I told my brother that I want to be just like this guy when I grow up. So the next day he bought me my first guitar and I started practicing and practicing. Right now. 
Uh, I remember that moment very well. I got an old VHS tape from my brother-in-law. Uh, it was taped with some video clips from MTV, mostly Queen Roxette, Michael Jackson. Uh, but there was also White Dove. Uh, I told him that I liked it a lot, so he gave me a stuff CD. <laughs> y lo compré en una tienda de unos hippies que vendían, tenían varios cassettes y, y me llamó la atención uno y lo compré y ahí me gustó y desde ahí no he dejado de escuchar el Big City Nights It was played in, the, in, in my mom's car and I tried to sing along even though I couldn't speak a single word of English It was my boyfriend at the time that played the song for me, and while he's long gone, the song still remains special to me. It was summer of 1988, and it was my cousin who told me, listen to this song, it's fantastic. Holiday! It was on my dad's uh, car in the city, and uh, just accidentally hear it, and uh, I pretty like it. I was in the car when I was driving with my mom. I was approximately uh, six years old um, and it was holiday. In spring 84 on the German radio. In 1984 off of the uh, Love at First Sting album, a buddy of mine were in the uh, way up in the mountains of uh, Western Montana and he, he popped in a uh, a cassette and Rocky Like a Hurricane started playing. The the cage and the jail cut. Love at first thing. Here I am. Rock you like your hurricane. Rock you like your hurricane. Yeah. <laughs> Flight of the Rainbow. Tokyo Dreams. Love Drive. Animal Magnetism. Love Drive. 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 Love Drive.
video. Thank you very much. I'm very honored to be a part of the Scorpions fan movie. Uh, give me two minutes, I will show you some stuff. So this I did for Mickey D. It's a, a, a shirt, you know, which you use for interviews. I have, uh, or I created uh, three or four versions. We'll come here, we'll show you. So let's go. So what else we have? The new MJ guitar advertising sign, the guitar which you know. It's for him and Rabbit with the glitter drumsticks down under in Hamburg, St. Pauli, Hardwood Cafe, the old advertising sign. This is a white MJ guitar cap with a black one, you see. Uh, one of the glitter artworks here also hanging at MJ Guitars. This is an MJ guitar glitter artwork hanging also at the store. One of the anniversary shirts, one of the caps, the guest book, Ping, Bon Jovi, they're all signed in. So Matthias himself, Tokyo Sticks for uh, Herman Rebel. So the Tokyo Sticks for the German, uh, for the Japanese tour uh, with Michael Schenker. This is, was signed by uh, Uli Roth and Uli John Roth and uh, Michael Schenker. The sound is a plate of guitar, you know, it's a part of the guitar. So lots of stuff, the white. Uh, shirt, Scorpion shirt was also created for Mickey D for his promo tours, interviews and so on. The anniversary shirt, okay, you know that, and the uh, Scorpion's Sennheiser special edition microphone. This I created also for Mickey D, very lavish, was really lots of hours work. This one here, also for his promo tours, so this hanging with MJ guitars, also those, right. A lot of stuff for MJ Guitars. Yeah? I'm sure you know all the symbols or also the logos. Yeah, it's the old one, Rock World Forever in a special edition. And uh, my Monaco Pirates guitar, which was there for I think three years at the store. Yeah, good. Then let me say, um, very nice. So keep on rocking. Humanity, you are rocky like a hurricane, wind of change, and the uh, Don't believe her. Don't stop at the top. Uh, the best is yet to come. Worldwide Worldwide life. Life. Believe, believe in love. love. Follow your heart. The zoo? No, no one like you. The you in there? To be number one, it's like a mini film, and uh, it's very eccentric. It's very unusual and not typical of the scorpions. But it's really fun to watch. <laughs> I still love you. When you came into my life, I believe in you. you. Because I happened to work on that one when it was shot in 84 in New Jersey. And it's kind of funny. I spent more time talking to the guys than actually working on the video. Big city nights. Their final quote unquote concert. The Rocky Like a Hurricane video they released to promote their DVD Forever in the Day. Oh. It's actually a movie, and uh, Forever in a Day, I'll tell you what, this tells the story. I thought, think it was captured excellent. It was our fourth attempt at a documentary, and it worked great. The, the US Festival, or the US Festival of 1983. We built this house. I rock, and in the community of Scorpions, not like others or others. Este, estamos cerca, compartimos experiencias, anécdotas y sobre todo la pasión por Scorpions. Bad boys running wild.
Late last year, we lost our good Scorpion fan friend, Rudy Ray, unexpectedly. Some of you probably know him as Scorps for Life on the Scorpion Forum from a long time ago. Um, we miss him greatly, and I know he's traveling with the Scorpions now to all their shows. to the best German hard rock heavy metal band ever. The best rock band in the world. What? You never heard of Scorpions? Are you kidding me? Where have you been hiding, mate? Under a rock? They've got over 20 albums. They've got rock ballads, rock music. They've got love songs. There's just so much different music they got. Over 20 albums to choose from. You're going to be in for some experiences when you listen to Scorpions after this, mate. You wouldn't want to miss out. Scorpions are Germany's number one rock band of all time. One of the classic rock bands that I know that have positive vibes in their songs and are absolutely worth listening to. I'd say that they are my favorite band and if you like really, really good music with nice vibes, you gotta check them out. They are really the ultimate rock band in my life. I, I don't know anyone who would... Mm, how to say... Uh, fill my heart with music. I want to listen to them. It's not only great musicians, but also people with a Russian heart. Scorpions is a very famous German rock and roll band that have been around for over 50 years. I'd ask them if they know songs like Wind of Change, Rock Like a Hurricane or Still Loving You because usually people do know those songs but they do not know they are from Scorpions. Primeiro de que uma banda de rock alemã e a melhor banda do mundo e a banda da minha vida. Scorpions is the best band forever and they are the best human beings with the best vibes. É simplesmente a melhor e a maior banda de rock and roll do de todo mundo, de todo planeta. One of the greatest rock and roll bands on the face of the, this earth. They're humanitarians and they cater to their fans and they love their fans. They're worth listening to, like every single album, old and new. They were one of the best rock bands, definitely one of the top five rock bands ever <laughs> in all of existence. And then I'd probably ramble on about how awesome they were. This band has been together 50 plus years. They have a multitude of musical genres, um, something for everybody in every category. They just are an amazing, amazing group of, of human beings. That's how I start. Scorpion is a band of rock alemán that viene haciendo music desde los años 50. And a través de estos 50 años, han demostrado que con su música, lo que es ser una banda, la unidad de ellos después de tanto tiempo y permanecer vigente después de tantos años. Words are just not enough. Scorpions is the greatest rock band in the world. They also are the greatest ballad band in the world. What can I say? One must listen Scorpions to know what it is and feel the joy they bring when they perform. It's the best group of the universe. The best at all points. Niveau chant et instrumental. That they are absolutely amazing and they are a uh, German rock band. Scorpion is a group mythique, legendary, that you absolument aller les voir en concert, uh, écouter leur musique parce que c'est énorme. The best band in the world. The number one rock band in the world. They are on top since more than 40 years. They are founded in the 1960s in Hanover, Germany, and the frontman Klaus Meiner 
is the best rock singer in the world for me. Who are the Scorpions? My answer would be my favorite band. Ja, auf die Frage würde ich antworten, denn uh, dass die Scorpions die größte Rockband aller Zeiten aus Deutschland sind. If anyone came up to me and asked me who the Scorpions were, I sure as hell wouldn't talk to them anymore. <laughs> it's just disrespectful, isn't it? Scorpions is a very famous rock band. They have 50 years of history behind them. The greatest rock and roll band in history of rock. They are um, the greatest rock band in the planet that uh, never stops touring, the, that they have unlimited energy which they show every time on stage. That Klaus Mind, the singer of uh, the band, has uh, one of the most melodic voices on the planet. The Scorpions is my life, they are everything to me. And isn't this t-shirt enough to say who they are? They are a rocking band! Hey, they're the, the best band in the world. In the world, I was like, I'm very concerned about the Scorpions, who are so sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry, 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 I'm so sorry. Well, I just want to ask you, what is this dress? I can tell you that this dress is a dress of the تحقق یکی از بزرگترین آرزوهای کودکی منه که اونم رفتن به کنسرت اسکورپیونز بوده If somebody asks me who are the scorpions then my only answer would be and quoting James Kotak if aliens invade planet earth and say what is rock and roll then the answer would be simply the scorpions the best rock band ever and uh, after 53 years their shows are still exciting and powerful I probably say to them one of the most heavy, greatest legends, uh, legendary musicians of all time. My reaction would be very angry, and I would say, get out of my sight. But uh, usually what I will say is, uh, do you know Wind of Change or Send Me an Angel or Still Loving You? And most of the time people yes, say yes, we know the song. I just answered one of the best rock bands ever. Le diré que rayos, de que eso no sabes quiénes son Scorpions. Scorpions es todo, es todo para mí. Es una de las mejores bandas en el mundo. Tienes que escucharlos. Y... My friend, I see for first time my Scorpions t-shirt. And today is a big Scorpion fan like me. It's an old, very old German band uh, with one Polish member. Scorpions? Scorpions is a life. I'd probably start by explaining exactly why they're one of the greatest rock and roll bands in the world and then also talk about why they're important to me. Oh, Scorpions is a classic rock. And Scorpions should listen to almost everyone. Every person should know at least one song from Steel Loving You or Maybe I Maybe You, the most simple songs. And Incredibly talented people who make the music that you can hear in the world. Incredibly talented people who make the music that you can hear in the world. Incredibly talented people who had arrived to change the world by their talent, by their love to their vocation, to that world, and by their love to that life. It is very important for me. And they did it. Встречу ли я человека, который спросит у меня, кто такие Scorpions? Я думаю, никогда не встречу. Таких людей нет. Все прекрасно знают эту группу. Кому-то она нравится, кому-то она не нравится, но таких людей, кто не знает о ней, не существует. That Scorpions is the best example how you can make your dreams come true. Your dream should be a guiding star in the darkness, and you will be able to rock the world like a hurricane. Scorpions – это группа из Ганновера, Германия, которая образовалась более 50 лет назад и с тех пор играет свои концерты по всему миру. He just arrived in Russia. I would be surprised, like, how is it possible that you don't know who Scorpions is? Let me show you. This is my favorite band. Greatest rock band. They teach us to look at life from the point of love, goodness, trust and hope. I answer that they are great guys from Hanover. It's the best German band ever. Scorpions – это легендарная немецкая рок-группа, которая достигла популярности и успеха во всем мире.
Scorpions is love, life and rock. Scorpions is uh, one of uh, better parts of 80s and without it there is no 80s. Чувак, ты с какой планеты пришёл? If I would meet a person who doesn't know scorpions, actually I always meet these persons and wearing scorpions t-shirt, actually I'm always wearing scorpions t-shirt. I would say that it's the best band from Hanover. It's a classic of rock. It's the band that you I'm sure you know at least one or two songs of them and you need to listen to more because they bring the light to your life. This is a rock and roll band and they rock and roll music and uh, ballads. They are very well known uh, and involved. They are the greatest German rock band. I'll probably just say it's my favorite rock band. Scorpions is the greatest rock band. They were the first foreign rock band that came to USSR. These guys are more than 50 years on the stage. I respect and love for Scorpions and their music. Scorpions is a legendary rock group. Я бы сказал, что это великая немецкая рок-группа, которая создала свой необыкновенно острый, ужаленный э, стиль э, в рок-н-ролле. Ну, ну, люди знают просто эту группу, знают, чем они знамениты. Для них задать вопрос, а кто это вообще и чем они известны, это очень странно. Я на это отвечаю, что Scorpions это самая крутая и замечательная группа, на концерт которой я всегда готова поехать в любую точку мира that they uh, really keen on Russia and uh, start to tell about their trips from Kaliningrad to Vladivostok and their open-air concert in Kemerova during minus 20 degrees Celsius. The rock group on the earth. Take my phone and play their music. And I would say, those are the Scorpions. Best rock and roll band ever. The best rock group ever! Yeah! And forever! The Scorpions are the best rock band in the world. That all depends. If it's someone you just casually meet in the street and they ask you, simply explain, hey, it's one of the greatest bands in history. Now, if it's someone you see in a music club that should know better, my reaction would say, are you nuts? Um, yeah, how could you not know the Scorpions? The Scorpions are my favorite band of all time. Go check out Love at First Sting. I'd say you've got to be kidding, but they're my favorite band and very well known for a lot of songs, including No One Like You and Rock You Like a Hurricane. Surely you've heard that one. If someone asked me or saw me wearing a scorpion shirt and asked me who the scorpions were, <laughs> I would say, what planet are you from? Somebody says, hey, who's scorpion? What? Are you joking? Usually I punch them, but then I say, here I am, rock you like a hurricane, and problem solved. An incredible, incredible group of people who have provided so much entertainment and joy. Their music is, is special, it, it, it can lift you up in a dark time of your life. It can, uh, it can give you the goosebumps or the chills listening to it at, at, at times. Um, they're just a really good group of, of people who have made a, a success out of music and they've just provided so much pleasure for so many years for so many people. I would simply say, sit down and let me educate you and give them a lesson and tell them they're the best band ever and still going strong. German rock gods. I just asked them to listen to the most famous songs. I don't Кто такие Scorpions? Я говорю, что это моя любимая рок-группа и настоящие легенды рок-н-ролла. Я обязательно советую поискать и послушать их композиции.
James Kotek here, uh, scorpions, kingdom come, etc. blah, blah, blah. I'm in my natural habitat, of course. I'm in my kitchen with every gadget known to mankind. And how would I describe scorpions fans? Well, first of all, cuckoo, cuckoo. They're all insane. And the craziest things I've ever seen scorpions fans do, I mean, they've baked us cakes and done some really weird things, but it's all in love. And I like that very much so. And uh, I'm gonna make you some nice juice here in a minute. And I've got my bread machine, I got my juicer, and I blah, blah, blah. But I'll tell you what, I have to say the Greeks are probably the wackiest, man. They're lighting off fireworks out in the audience. They're lighting off things that I didn't even know existed and doing crazy things and showing up at the hotel at like two o'clock in the morning, banging on my door. And uh, how did they find my room? You! So the question is, do I have any favorite Scorpion songs? Of course I do. My number one song has always been, Girl, girl, I'm leaving you. I've got to go tonight. We played it a few times, but it just never happened. Um, and on another note is, um, <laughs> there's not one Scorpion. The first Scorpion song I think I ever heard was No One Like You. And that was back in like 1947 or 48, something like that. I want to send a message out to you Scorpion fans. You guys are the nuttiest, coolest, freakiest people I've ever met. I'm so proud and thankful to know you. And it's like really cool that, you know, I get to speak with you. Anyway, thank you Joanne so much because she's one cool chick who's always been a supporter of James Kotak. And uh, I hope to see you guys out there again. I'm working on Kingdom Come, and I'm still buddies with my Scorpion guys, and everything's really pretty cool. And, uh, oh, my refrigerator. Ah! Anyway, I look forward to seeing you all again really soon. And uh, as we always say, rock and roll forever. Hey, let's go! Yeah.
chores. A new album. I need the new ideas. To hear the new ideas from, from the Scorpions. Musical ideas. Album. They keep on touring as long as they are in good health and uh, they enjoy it. I want more. Чтобы больше туров. Я надеюсь, что они снова приедут в мой родной Ташкент, и я попаду на их выступление. In the northeastern United States. Uh, one or two, or maybe more records. Yes, do a bunch of tours. What I want more from the Scorpions in the future, album or tour, um, I would like to have a new album. New album, definitely, because they will tour, for sure. Please, more tours. Any tour, acoustic, electric, symphonic any tour. We want to see you more and more times. Please make a new album and never stop. The new album because if they are playing the tours it's just for the people who are on the tour and, uh, and when they are doing the album it's for everyone. Scorpions concerts! Yay! Scorpions concerts! More Scorpions concerts! Especially in Adelaide, South Australia. Please Scorpions! <laughs> Un nouvel album avec des nouvelles musiques à écouter. More tours, uh, but I'd really like small, you know, a tour in small venues uh, for more intimacy. A new album with Mickey and uh, I want to listen to Klaus Weiss again. You can't deny that Scorpions didn't finish their way in the rock music. So the best is yet to come. I just have to release studio albums number 19 and 20. Surely prefer the tours. I want from the Scorpions more tours. A new album with new songs. If only they have the interest to, to write some songs and to produce some songs on their own and not uh, producer songs and uh, other uh, songwriters. The album because new songs are always a cool thing. I want more albums and more tours and of course more backstage pass. <laughs> Olha, se fosse para escolher entre um álbum novo e uma turnê, eu ficaria com a turnê, porque eu teria a oportunidade de ver eles por mais várias vezes pelo planeta Terra. Their new album. Uh, many, almost every fan uh, would say the same to the Scorpions: change the setlist. Not totally, but at least two or three new songs would be cool. A concert in my hometown and. Perhaps a new record would also be nice. Play in Peru for the first time. New album, uh, new material. Uh, we love the tours, they're a fantastic live band, probably the greatest live band ever. Always love to hear new stuff. In fact, I'd love to hear them record each album they've done live and release that. More tours, especially to Russia or Belarus. I really don't need a new album, but I have to meet them again and again and again and again. A new album. Have a new tour instead of a new album. I mean, I would really, really prefer him to play in again in Mexico City. I would happen to say at this point, a new album. A new album with um, heavier rock and roll, lots of guitar riffs, really heavy stuff. Throw in their signature ballads in with it, you know, write some new ones, and then they will have new material to go on tour with for maybe their actual final tour. But yeah, that would be great to have a nice new set list. A new album from them more than new tours. J'aimerais beaucoup un nouvel album avec des riffs et des sons comme dans la période de John Watt. Du vrai son à la Scorpion. Tout est doué, non c'est pas. Forse, forse il tour, perché li ho visti una volta dal vivo quando avevo 18 anni, è stato credo il mio primo concerto dal vivo, è stato veramente una cosa magica. I think uh, they can record a new disc and I believe they will. I think they will uh, play more concerts 
Then uh, record. Acho que um novo álbum, mais um novo álbum. É certeza que tem mais turnês também. Um Scorpion Festival with few hits of the last few years has been very close. Больше well, туров. Насколько это возможно, даже в России? An album because they will be touring anyway. It's easy question. Touring, you know, I want to see them live. I haven't had the chance yet. I'm, I'm a live guy, so I would I would have to go with more tours. More albums because there were so many uh, farewell tours and uh, I don't believe it anymore. So just music, that's what I love. Me gustaría elegir tours, puesto que me gustaría verlos más seguido por Sudamérica. Что я жду от группы, это, конечно же, творчество. Это это творчество, это это альбом, который будет концептуальным, в котором все-таки будет больше смысла, чем в предыдущем альбоме, вот, и, конечно, тура, тура, потому что без встречи с прекрасной группой это очень трудно себе представить. Больше туров. More tours because I want to see you again soon. В будущем я больше всего ждаю Scorpions, чтобы они все были живы, здоровы, а соответственно, если все будут живы и здоровы, они будут продолжать нас радовать своим творчеством. More tour dates in the United States. Uh, a new album that will fe will be featuring some of the most iconic songs of the band, and that we th uh, they will be recorded again. Uh, in their age right now because I think it will be something different something new for every band in the world of course I want them to tour again because I can never get enough Scorpions Хочется, конечно же, услышать от Scorpions нового альбом в будущем, в ближайшем но больше всего хочется, чтобы группа приехала с новым туром по России And I would love for them to tour just one more time. Мне не важны их альб... сколько они выпустят альбомов. Мне самое главное, чтобы они были живы и здоровы. In the future, I really hope that the Scorpions will announce that they are coming back on tour because I really miss them. В следующем году от Scorpions жду все же больше концертов. Больше туров, ну и по возможности, конечно, больше концертов в России. Ich hätte gern noch ein weiteres Album. Natürlich nicht uneigennützig, da würde ich gern mitmachen, wenn ich darf. Äh, ist schon lange her, dass es so war, aber naja, ich hoffe immer noch, dass ich noch mal eine Chance bekomme. In будущем ожидаю обязательно еще не раз посетить концерты Scorpions. And I would love to see a, co a concert in Western Canada. The Scorpions have never been to Malta. So, my wish for the future is, Scorpions, come to Malta! I am waiting for new songs. Because Rudy, Rudy, he will never lose. He will always have new songs. One thing that I would like to say is, Scorpions, I would like to see the concert in the United States. A new album. I probably have to go for a new album. I'd love to see them live again on stage, but rather with some setlist changes. Um, another aspect why I choose tours is because more tours would especially mean that I'd meet fellow Scorpions fans that I've known for a couple of years. Um, they are fans from all over the world and I really love to meet a lot of them again, one day or another.
day. Scorpions forever! And remember, Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever! Scorpion forever! Yeah! Scorpions forever! Thank you! Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever! Woohoo! Scorpions forever! Yeah! Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Yeah. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever, forever scorpions. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever. Is scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. A scorpion forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Oh, yeah. Scorpions forever. Rock like hurricane. Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever! Yeah! Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever! Scorpions forever, yeah! <laughs> Scorpions forever! Yeah, Scorpions forever! Scorpions in my heart. Forever. <laughs> Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Forever as Scorpions. Scorpions forever. And 
Scorpius forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Yeah. Scorpion forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Yeah. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever. Scorpions forever! That's my heavy metal voice. Anyway, Scorpions forever and rock and roll forever. Scorpions forever! Let's go dance with Scorpions there, right? about 40 years on stage. Let's go, let's go! Some, some, some songs <laughs> of their own. There's a Scorpions community out there. I mean, this, this shirt I have on, for instance. The Berlin Fan Meeting of 2016. I got this t-shirt at a, a, at a worldwide fan party in December of 2016 in Berlin the day before the last show of the 2015-2016 tour. There was probably 60, 80, 100 people at the Hofbrau in Berlin. We all met and we were all Scorpions fans from all over the world. I met people from all over the world. I've, I've made friends from people all over the world. Kind, caring, great people, just a really sense of, of you know, togetherness and community, and if that's not about one of the grooviest things I can think of, I don't know what it is, man. Hey guys, after 35 years, I'm still loving you. There's no one like you, and you rock my life like a hurricane. I think Klaus is a hunk of doodle. I love him. He's Gorgeous, great voice. Or are you glad you can hang out in my kitchen? Anyway, check this out. Oh, there's a cat. Of course, of course, I will be living forever in our hearts and in our minds and in our souls. And, and we'll, we'll always love you guys. Thank you. The Scorpions rock. We built this house on a rock. Yeah! One love. Uh, that's it. 